Monday. So I think I've gone a bit mad with online adverts on Instagram and TikTok and things. When I see them, I'm like, oh, that would be good for a video. Oh, that would be good for a video. Why well, I buy that and put it in my videos and see what you guys think. So I ended up doing it again. You've probably seen it advertised on Instagram, Facebook, TikTok, blah, blah, blah. And it is portrayed to be this amazing skin transforming product that makes your skin just look flawless. It's supposed to cover tattoos, it's supposed to cover spots, it's supposed to make your skin look amazingly smooth. So I guess let's try it, see if it's true. So I'm in front of the window right now, I'm hoping that there's no kind of lines or reflections or anything so you can see my natural skin. So I've got no foundation on, I've just done my eyebrows and put a little bit of mascara on and that's about it. But this is my natural skin, I've got redness, I've got spots here, there and everywhere. I always get really red here. It's not as bad as it used to be, mind, the products that I've been using lately are just amazing. Like I used to get a red forehead and that's not red anymore and around here but no. So this is what the product came like. I'll put a link to it below by the way if you want to check it out yourself. We'll see. We'll see how this video goes. So it's called Beauty Cream Images. Literally. So I have no idea what that means. And it says on the bottom, Hydro Silky Beauty Cream. But I was under the impression it was a foundation, not a cream. It is a foundation, not a cream. So in the box, you get, so you had the choice to get it with the brush or without the brush. So I got it with the brush. You know the, I'll put the advert here so you can see. So it's like that spongy brush. And it comes in a little bag, which I think is actually really quite cute. So let's get it out of the bag. I haven't looked at it yet to see what it actually looks like. So that's the spongy thing. That's really nice actually. So that's like a foundation sponge on a little stick. So then the cream foundation is inside. Let's get that out. I'm actually looking forward to using this. If it if the adverts are true and it works like that, then I'm actually pretty stoked and excited about it. Stoked? I've never used that word before. Pretty excited about it. <laughs> so this is it. All right. So I wonder if it does that pattern, you know, the pattern thing that it says that it does. So let's have a look. Okay, it's a lot less in there than what I would expect if that's what you get. Mm -hmm. Okay, so I'm guessing you just take this off. All right, so I managed with a little bit of swearing to get that spongy thing out. Let's see if it does the pattern. It does, <laughs> it does the pattern. Okay, let's see what it does with my red skin. I should tell you the shade that I chose. Um, by the way, the packaging's all in Chinese. I think it's Chinese. Um, and this doesn't actually say what shade, but I'll put the shade Oh, well, I'll put it here so that you know what shade I'm actually using. So, this bit here is really, really, like, weirdly spongy. And the stuff inside's really quite watery. Like, it's a lot waterier than I expected. A lot more water. Oh, it smells nice. Actually smells really good. So, that's like a really light covering of foundation 
to be honest that matches my skin really well let's try it on the other side my skin is naturally quite light so it, ma it matches really really well and it's covered the redness it smells gorgeous I'm quite present present I'm quite pleasantly surprised actually about this I feel like you should I should be doing this like stippling but on the advert they do that but I don't feel like that's I don't know should I I'll do that doesn't feel like this is meant for that it's meant for stippling by I think this feels like it's meant for stippling so that's what I'm gonna do I feel like this is gonna run out pretty quick although it, it is still coming out I'm not sure how many goes you'll get out of it let's do the test under the eyes that look like quite glowy compared to the other side that's that side that's this side let's try the forehead oh, it's lovely and cool as well it smells amazing, it goes on really, really cool. We'll do one side of the forehead. I hope the light's alright. I haven't got my, I've got my ring light on the lowest setting because I understand some of my videos are far too bright. I might actually leave my ring light off for some of them, but look. One side not done, the other side done. Here's from far away. It's a really subtle foundation, like as if you haven't got any foundation on but your skin's really just quite smooth. I mean it's not as dramatic or drastic by any means like what the adverts portray, but things never are, you know? I wouldn't expect it to like cover every single blemish. Or would I? <laughs> wow! I'm actually quite impressed with that. My ears get quite red. Let's do my ears. It's so easy to apply as well. This, I love this. I really do. It's so good. So, my verdict, actually, I really like it. Look how, like in the mirror, it looks different to what it does here, but it looks flawless either way. I am very, very impressed with that. The only thing about it is, I'm not sure how much you actually get in here, whether it just goes to the bottom of there or whether it goes all the way to the bottom of here. I wonder if you do that. Yeah, I think you tip it. It's quite watery, that's the only thing. But then, because it's watery, it doesn't look caked, you know? I hate makeup that feels and lo looks and feels caked. So because I've already done my eyebrows and eyeshadow, it's gonna be difficult to do this bit squash it wow I'm actually quite impressed nothing wrong with that at all so I'll leave the link for it in the description like I say I'll leave the price down there as well um, where I got it from and if you want to try it and then go and check it out. I'll not get anything for it. I just, it's just to help you 
buy products that if you see them you like them and you want to buy them but yeah I'm actually quite impressed with that it's unusual to actually come across a product that's widely plastered all over social media and it be actually quite good but yeah I'm pretty impressed with that all right guys so if you enjoyed this video please give it a big thumbs up and subscribe to my channel and um, get me to that thousand go on get me to that thousand <laughs> so as always love doing my videos I've loved this one and I'll be filming another one straight after this because that's how committed I am and I just want to wish you a lovely weekend enjoy yourselves guys have fun and I'll see you in my next video bye